let's take a look at how many stars there are in the universe. Welcome to the Space Series, I'm Joe Nankton and I hope you like this video. So, how many stars are there? We don't actually know, but one of the first questions we can try to answer is how many stars can we see? If we go to a remote place like in Alaska where there's no light pollution and you have some pretty good eyesight, you can see around two to three thousand points of light. There isn't really an exact number because different eyes can see different things. You obviously can't see all of the night sky because half of it is obscured by the Earth, but there are around 5,000 stars which you can see from the surface of the planet. These points of light aren't just stars though, as there are some man-made satellites that are visible from the Earth. Of course, all eight planets can occasionally appear as points of light in the sky. And there are two galaxies that are visible, which are Andromeda and the Dimmer M81. They could have given a better name than that, couldn't they? This brings us on to the next question. How many stars are there in our galaxy? This number is approximately 200 billion stars. It is impossible, of course, to count them all. Some estimates put this number as 400 billion stars. And we'll do this by calculating the mass of the galaxy. Yes, we can calculate the mass of the galaxy. But that number is nothing when you think about the number of stars that are in the whole universe. Though from planet Earth we can only see two galaxies, there could be up to a trillion galaxies in the universe. When NASA pointed the Hubble telescope at a tiny bit of the sky and left the shutter open for about a few days, the photo showed thousands of galaxies. That picture gave us an estimate of one septillion stars in the universe. It is said that there's probably more stars in the whole of the universe than the greatest sand on Earth. That's it for today. Thanks for watching and I'll see you again next time. Bye bye.